Hey girls, today's video is going to be on my go-to look that I usually do for my blog posts and anytime I want to get dressed up for daytime. It's just a soft glam that's super simple and easy to do and if you want to see how I get this look then please keep watching. I'm using my current favorite foundation which is Too Faced Born This Way and I absolutely love the way it makes my skin look. It's just a dewy natural finish with medium to buildable coverage and it looks really beautiful in photos. And I'm just buffing that in with my Real Technique sponge. For concealer I'm using IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye and I usually buff this in with my warm finger but today I'm using a brush. I prefer my finger just because it gives more coverage but I absolutely love this concealer. And I'm just blending that in with my Real Technique sponge. I'm highlighting with Max Prep and Prime in the shade Light Boost and I love highlighting with this rather than a concealer because it's not as thick and it doesn't look cakey at all. Set underneath my eyes, I'm using Hourglass's Ambient Lighting Powder in the shade Diffuse Light, and I love it because it doesn't look cakey and it just prevents from creasing. My favorite product for my brows is the Anastasia Brow Wiz, and I'm in the shade Taupe. And then I just clean up a little bit with some foundation and buff that in with my finger. And then I set my brows with the Maybelline Brow Drama. For my eyes, I'm packing this highlight shade all over my lids. And then for the crease, I'm using Max Hoax Eyeshadow. And I really like this color for my crease. For eyeliner, I'm using Maybelline's Master Precise Liquid Eyeliner. And let me just tell you how stressful it is to put eyeliner on while on camera. <laughs> like, don't you just hate when that happens? No worries, I fixed it and I'm just going to add a small wing. To define my lower lash line, I'm using NYX eyeshadow in the shade Taupe. For a soft contour, I'm using NARS Contour Blush in the shade Olympia. I really recommend this for anyone who just likes a natural looking contour or is fair skinned. For blush, I'm using Benefits Dallas and it's kind of just a glowy natural shade. And then for the apples of my cheeks, I use Max Melba Blush. I'm using CoverGirl Clump Crusher for my mascara and I really love how this separates my lashes. My favorite lashes from the drugstore are Ardell Glamour Wispies. They are absolutely beautiful and I was wearing these in my hijab tutorial as well. For highlight, I'm using Becca's Opal and I'm so sad because mine broke which is why I'm not showing it to you but it's a really beautiful highlight and I'm just putting at that in the normal places on top of my cheekbones and above my brow and my chin. And then I'm taking Mary Luminizer by the Balm and going over my cupid's bow and then right on the tops of my cheekbones again just to make it pop a little more. I'm taking Mary Luminizer again and highlighting the tip of my nose and my inner corners. I'm using L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara to go over my bottom lashes again and I love how it really lengthens it and makes them super black. And then I'm blending my real lashes with my falsies. I'm using Morphe Gel Liner to hide my lash band so that it looks more natural. And for my lips, I'm using ColourPop's Lippy Stick in the shade Lumiere and I absolutely love this shade on its own it's so much. It's so beautiful. It's like a mauve berry shade. And then I'm going over it with MAC Honey Love just to make it a little bit more neutral and nude. I 
hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thank you so so much for watching. Please leave me some more video requests in the comments below and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next one inshallah. Bye!